glistening sweat. Slippery goo. This preps the tune of Hano Beach going. Pinimini Our desperate need. You wanna become a Timiniku? What's that? I'm one of the staff members responsible for keeping Hano spotless for our guests. But Pinimini Simon has a wrinkle up on the beach. I don't know what to do with them. I'll just leave them there. They shrivel up on land. Not all. It's kinda gross. Aww. Catch one. Throw it back. Report it. You wanna do this? Sure, I'll chuck some. What is this, Minecraft? Right? I can see six left on the sand. Alright. Puke? You chucked him back into the sea. Sorry, guy. I'm helping. You look so sick. Get off me, bro! I'm trying to check out the thing floating in the water. Pearl string. I have seen that before. These things aren't annoying. I have made a mistake! All of my regrets are super early in the game. So I caught Eevee and then spent a bunch of time leveling it as happiness. And by running around a bunch, and got it to evolve into an Espeon. You poor guy. Get back in the ocean. When were you thinking of evolving Machop? Machoke? Probably right before Endgame. Probably right before Endgame. Goodbye! Is that all six? I think that's all six. No, one more. Poor little guy. I still don't have one. Bye-bye. Can I get a pet of one of those if I uh, succeed? Hello. The only reason I can luxuriate like this now is thanks to the work I do here on the beach. If you're interested in some part-time work, check out checking out some... Hello, poor guy. I'm gonna help you. Huge throw! He's gone! Hello! Good job, part-timer. That's the last bit. Give me the money! I want the money! Or a pamimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimimim
What? There are psychic... So, Raichu, depending on level, learns a, psych a psychic move. But, Raichu, Aloha and Raichu is electric psychic. Which means we have two characters that are weak to darkness. But we have Machop, who is a darkness destroyer. So, we should be okay. We should be okay. Now, we're finally going to solve the mysteries on this stupid island. Because God knows we haven't been here long enough. I want off the second island, man. This is the island I'm lost. I just want off it. Let me through. I have things to do. Like drink this delicious, delicious monster. Why, th why Raichu knows Thunder Tackle? Volt Tackle. And that's because there's a lady here who teaches Pikachu Volt Tackle. The, the downside is it's like takedown, though, so you're gonna do damage to yourself when you do it. And Raichu hits hard. Are y'all ready? I'm ready for this. Dun 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 dun! Get out of my way! Hello? Alola is how we say hello. I don't. G you're all useless. I'm not talking to you. Hey, Ether Foundation lady! So you've come at last. There's a move tutor in, uh, in the city we're in right now. What the fuck is up with your face, bro? This is not okay. Just look at that. Why would you... Why would you even wear that, man? Not okay. <laughs> ah, but forgive me. I have to introduce myself. You can call me Faba. And I told you before I would show you someplace astounding, right? Well, that... Wondrous place is Ether Paradise. It's like hell. Let me tell you about the Ether Paradise. It's where we destroy all human life on Earth. And leave only the Pokemon around. So I'm calling it now. Just as the name suggests, Ether Paradise is a veritable paradise for Pokemon that floats far out in the sea surrounding Alola. It is an artificial island made up entirely by human technology for protecting a Pokemon. It's like a wildlife preserve in the middle of nowhere. Of course I'm an adult who keeps his promises, so I will prove to you that all I have told you is the absolute truth. With a tour of Ether Paradise. Ooh, will you come, won't you? I do enjoy coming. Let's go! Good, good. You'll come with me to Ether Paradise and it will amaze you. Me too! Fuck off, Hal! Oh, even Kahuna Oli Olivia wants to see you off. Ha! <laughs> As a Kahuna, I look after trial goers who come to my island. They're like my own children. Not that I've got any. I've never married. Listen up, you two. Why does God be married have anything to do with getting children? Listen up, you two. Your greatest opportunity is always yourself, your greatest ally, the Pokemon beside you. Thanks! Are you coming too, Professor? Fuck no! I got shit to do, son! You go see all the amazing tech that the Ether Foundation is developing and tell me about it later, yeah? That's right, I'll see you on the next island. Aululululul island, yeah? Then let's meet up on Mally Garden! Yep, it's goodbye! Though I guess we can come back anytime we want, huh? No, you can't. Ever. Let's get on this boat. I'm on your boat. I'm on your boat. I'm on your boat. Hopefully the next place will let us buy hair pretties. This has been a, a recurring issue. Can you believe this big hunk of iron? Like either Paradise can float in the sea? Is it all because of Pokemon holding it? Did you know that, Flame Wheel? Because of the Pokemon holding it up. Really? I knew I could count on you to react. I'm gonna kill you, Hal. I'm gonna kill you at sea and throw you overboard. And no one's gonna notice. Ho! I can't wait to actually see it inside of the Ether Paradise myself. I feel like this is a bad idea. I am uncomfortable with this. I'm on your boat. I'm on your boat. Hello. It's the people who kidnapped Nebby. Nebby nappers. Oh, God. What have we done? All oh, the regrets. I hate your glasses, man! Here we are, the two. This is Aether Paradise. It's got pseudo widows and young gooses. I hope they kill each other. Huzzah! This place makes me feel uncomfortable. It, it, it feels off somehow. Probably not going to be doing competitive, no. Shiny hunting, yes. Competitive, no. So you have three starters. You have a Pokemon called Litten, that's a fire cat. You got Rowlet, which is a grass owl thing. And Popilo, which is a female looking freaking 
12.5% chance of being female freaking water type piece of garbage. Ether Paradise is a facility created for conservation of Pokemon. It has been outfitted with all the latest technology for this purpose. Downstairs, our team work on developing new Pokeballs and more. Yes, all for the sake of Pokemon conservation. I'm really uncomfortable about this place. Really uncomfortable. Though you will not be able to use any of your Pokeballs within the Ether Paradise, a jammy signal is broadcast to the facility to prevent you from doing so. Well then, why am I here? If I can't catch Pokemon, I must be lost. Must be lost. So sad. Excuse me, Mr. Faba. Fuck off, lady. I have a title for a reason. How else do you know I'm important? Ha! <laughs> important. Now I must speak with the president about our conservationism. <laughs> Show these children around and take them to meet the president as well. <sighs> I hate you all. I'm so uncomfortable about this place. It makes me feel... I feel... Ominous. Ominous! Your clothes are weird, sweetheart. Welcome to the Ether Paradise, Flame Will and How. My name is Wiki. Nice to meet you! Fuck you, Hal! Wait! You know who we are? How do you know that? Oh, one of the employees about at, told me about your meeting on Akala Island. And of course I heard how you helped protect the Pokemon there. Too young, Mr. Hal. Thank you so much. Let me show you around. The main entrance is up above us. Woohoo! I'm still got an ominous feeling, man. Anytime I've ever walked into a facility like this, I've either had to bomb it, because we're playing Final Fantasy, or we get to the top, find out they're all criminals, and have to kill our way through back to the boat. I am not okay with this. Not okay with this. And they kidnapped Nebby. This is the main entrance. You can have your Pokemon taken care of at the reception desk here if you need it. Pikachu! Oh, it's a sexy team. Thank you. Flame Wheel! You and Hal are both trial goers, aren't you? Are you hoping to become champions? Fuck yeah! You must be around 11. There's no way we're 11. You don't know me! Yeah, 11. Apparently we're 11. Awkward. How? How lovely for you. I suppose all children must yearn to take a journey after they're choosing when they get to be about your age. Though you hardly just children anymore. Trainers are like parents to them. That's not how that works! That's not how any of this works. Flame Wheel, how? Would you like- Would you two like to see the conservation area upstairs? I'm still uncomfortable with this whole situation right now. I don't know what it is. It's off-putting. Ether Paradise is a safe haven for Pokemon. Except Nebby, you kidnappers! Huzzah! We kept Pokemon that have been targeted by Team Skull here. We also try and support Pokemon that need a little extra protection. Like Corsola, for example. They're quite terribly overhunted by Pokemon called Toxapex. I hope you don't mind if I ran a pa read a passage from my Pokedex. I don't care! <gasps> it's a Corsola! He's so cute! He's so cute! Torapex. Torapex crawls the ocean floor on its twelve legs. It leaves a trail of course of the bits scattered in its wake. Oh god! That's terrifying. That's what you say, nature's got a cruel side. <laughs> sure as it gives us blessings. But can the Ether Foundation really protect all the Pokemon that are out here? Fuck yeah, we can. Nature does have its own balance, of course. It can be difficult to judge just how much we humans should try to affect that, can't it? Fuck you, Hal! <laughs> but why even bother setting up a branch in a place like Alola? Dumbass. I couldn't say. It's hard to know for sure what our president is thinking sometimes. He's President Shinra! He's a monster! <laughs> if you'd like to meet President Lusamine, she should be here at the conservation area now. So much dialogue! I want to meet the president. Are you the president? No, you're not the president. Meet the president. Are you a president? You're not a president. Are you a president? You're not a president. You're a maniac. On the floor. Are you the president? No, you're the weird guy. Regional variants. I already know this shit. How are we still getting tutorial bullshit? Fuck all of you so hard. In your face. Where's the president? What the fuck is this? Look at this. Just a giant square. 
kill you all. What do we got going on over here? Corsula's dynamic camera angles. That's what we got going on here. Dynamic camera angles again. Hello. For more bullshit about regional variants. I don't need the backstory. Fuck Grimer. You know the shiny version of Grimer here is pink. It's just pink with the, the color rainbow throat thing. It's so stupid. Speaking of other things that are stupid. Aha! Story. My sweet Pokemon. I promise I'll keep you safe. I'll protect you with my love. And heavy weapons! Like the machine gun! Ah! I read that. Alright, bitch, what the fuck's up with your hair? And your shoes. Who has toe shoes? <laughs> you must be Flame Will and How. Welcome to the Ether Paradise, the Ether Foundation's own private island. I'm the president of the foundation, but please, you can call me some stupid fucking name! I'm so glad that we got to meet you. I'm not. I'm glad that people like you, who travel to the islands to learn more about Pokemon, but there are those unfortunate Poke people who harm Pokemon to their own selfish reasons, or even for profit. I like money! I just like beating up other people's Pokemon for money, though. I'm a good person! And this is why I'm here. I will be like a mother to all those poor Pokemon and shower them with love. You're fucking weird, lady! Even Pokemon from distant worlds, far away from Alola region, are worthy of my love. Even Nebby! I don't know how you do all this. You're like not even much older than us! Ha! <laughs> you dumb shit! I'm already over 40. What? I expected a shock look on his face. There we go. Wait, what? Yeah, exactly. Oh, you. The right style does wonder. You know? And how. Your style's a bit wanting. I'll have to take you out sometime and get you a better outfit. Like what you wear. <laughs> I don't think anyone else can pull that off kind of look. Except maybe Lily. I bet she's Lily's sister. Oh, don't you worry. You just leave everything up to me. Trust me, children. Would be much happier if only listen to adults around them. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Plot holes! Conveniences! Monsters! <laughs> Our characters just standing there smiling, don't give a fuck. <laughs> that tremor, did something happen to the lower floors? I'm guessing Team Skull. Team Skull happened. Oh, there you go. Oh, fuck! Who are you? It's an octopus! Uh, it's an Ultra Beast! It's a Final Fantasy boss mob. I'll kill you where you stand! Maybe. There we go. Did you come from another world? <laughs> Miss Lumi, stand right there. Or stand back. That's not right. It's gonna final flash us. We're all dead. You poor creature. You're a dumb bitch. Alright. Let's do this. Let's go. <laughs> Fight me, bro. I should have saved first. God damn it. <laughs> Three question marks has appeared. Oh, fuck! Alright, Manti. Show us your metal. Uh, Petal Blizzard. It's brand new, let's try it out. Venoshock! Fuck. That's not good. That's not good at all. Does that mean it's poison? It's not weak. Uh, okay, it wasn't resistant. So if we live this, he's dead. I don't. I hate Venom Shock, dude. That shit sucks. Manti might cry. Doesn't matter. We'll hit him with that hot, hot Z power. And then it won't matter, Manti. You got this. Let's send him to his doom. It's a flowery death. It's so fluffy. Goodbye, punk. 
My defense is raised. You're still dead. Metal Shock does double damage to the opponent's poison. Oh, I know. Manti gained a bunch of XPs. Good, she's adorable. Kitty grew to level 34. Shit just got weird, bro. Shit just got weird. Oh, shit! He evolves at level 34. Who knew? I didn't know. I can't. That is what just happened. I was expecting level 36 to be on the real. But he also evolved at a weird level, too. Like 17 or some shit. Wah -ha! What? John Cena? Dun, 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 dun. This Pokemon has a violent, selfish disposition. And it's not in the mood to listen. It will ignore its trainer's orders and complete nonchalantness. You can't see him, though. You can't see him. Let's see, what do you want to learn, bro? Wants to learn Darkest Lariat. That's John Cena. Dun, 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 dun. And, 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 he learned a thing. It's fading from existence. This Final Fantasy VII music, though. Listen to it. The unidentif unidentified creature disappeared. Ha! Huh? Too strong. So it's true. I still need that Pokemon. I need to get it back. What? Miss Lumison, what are you talking about? I need Nebby. That creature we just saw was undoubtedly an Ultra Beast. An unknown being from another dimension that suddenly appeared from that wormhole. Do you see that smile on her face? Bitch is crazy. It looks like it was suffering. Like it was pain to be in this strange place. I can't bear to see that happen. I will save it. I will love it. Because she doesn't sound like a serial killer. Thank you both. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I'm helping. Wiki. These two are still in the middle of their island shells, aren't they? Get rid of them! Get them out of my house now! I will go check on that poor resident Pokemon came to any harm. And I need to speak to you with Mr. Faba about exactly what happened downstairs. And of course, I will start preparing the foundation for our newest and perhaps greatest duty yet. The protection of the Ultra Beast. Bitch! You're crazy! I'll see you two to the shit-ass island. Thank you! Get me off this boat. Goodbye, crazy psychopath. Have fun. I hope you get eaten by the Ultra Beast. Fucking hate Howl. <laughs> Sad face. I never thought I'd actually see the Ultra Wormhole in my life. <laughs> we gotta tell the professor. I don't know if that happened. Should be rightly described as an accident. But... Some random fuck honking his horn hella loud. <laughs> I think it's possible if you do so. Anyways, very glad to have met you both. Please take care and remember your visit. Some Masalda for how? I just want rare candy. Give me a rare candy! Uh, I hate you, Hal. You're so useless! A TM move, psychic! Huzzah! That's going right on, uh, Espeon. And anyone else who will learn it. I hope you both have wondrous adventures. Okay! Bye! Get me off this shit-ass island! Can't take it anymore! Alright, ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed what you saw today and you enjoyed what I do, please leave a like. If you're new to the channel and you haven't already, please subscribe. Thank you. Have a nice day. Goodbye!